there are six building blocks here on this site of about 5,000 square metres and they're going to be individually built they're owned by six individual people and I'm involved in four of them of which we're attempting to build a sustainable homes. My passion drives me to, to create a catalyst that actually spun, uh, spurs the, the community, the local street to follow and if I can do that and there is change made and people start changing the way that they, they live their lives and the thought processes that they have about the environment, then I've done my job. I'm trying to, to expose and uncover and to bring in the relevant information for my clients here such that they have a choice. With our agenda is an overview of sustainability in building. And I'd like to welcome three special guests from the University of New South Wales who are supporting me in my endeavours to build confidence in our industry with our consumers and earn trust so that everyone can follow, follow the good example that we must lead. How far can we go? Uh, these days we talk about zero carbon, uh, net zero energy buildings, uh, we talk about uh, zero emissions and, and a whole range of uh, sort of goals and targets. Uh, so, at some point, we need to have an idea uh, about uh, how long is the piece of string that we're talking about. You have your solar, your grid interactive solar system on your house, um, and you have a two-way meter, energy meter. One way, when you're putting energy into the meter, it winds, winds backwards. So if you can get it to wind back more than it winds forward, you get a check instead of a bill. That's great. What is going to be changing, and, and as, particularly with the government, has changed its, its rebate approach. They're moving to, most likely moving to a, a national feed-in tariff arrangement whereby you get a lot more money for the, for the renewable energy that you feed in. What I'm hearing around here, what I'm seeing around here and why we are here is I think people want to go beyond that. So to do that sort of thing, we start to look around for some additional information. And as I'm saying, a lot of this stuff is easily available to Google searches on sustainable buildings and so on. And by all means, you guys are working with your architects. That is very important. But at the same time, informed clients are very important. I think it's very hard for, to get four individual people with four different budgets and four different tastes and four different wives um, to agree to you know something that, especially in design, um, but I think you know, sharing water tanks, sharing grey water, maybe even having vegetable patches off like these kind of things are you know, like logical and rational decisions. It's it's for joining houses um, in the suburbs. Like me, uh, so I think that's that's unique. It's, it doesn't come up very often that you would have four houses that would be able to be built from scratch all at the same time in a highly um, urbanised area. It's unique.